Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're here playing Dragon City, and this is the Heroic Race. In this video, we're going to cover lap five. Right now, I'm on lap five, node three. Technically, I already finished the first node, which was to breed six different dragons. We're going to see the same technique that I used for that, basically just breeding the Terra and Terra dragons. It took a little bit of time, and uh, I definitely had to do it a bunch of times, but we ended up getting those olive branches in just a perfect amount of time. There's no minimum or no wait time there. And after we finished lap five, node one, we went on to lap five, node two, where we had to collect some food and collect some gold. For that, there was no minimum wait time either. And now we're up on ba -ba -ba -bum, lap five, node three. Here you can see that I fed my dragons and we got some of those beetles. Here I stopped at 26. You have a pool of 26 out of 35 that you can get. And then you have to wait an hour and three minutes to get the next one. Here, it's been an hour and three minutes, and it's time to go. Woo! Let's do this. So here, we're going to go ahead and feed a dragon, and we're looking for a bunch of those beetles. Um, I think nine to be exact. Let's go. Here, we're going to go ahead and put those in order. Oops, power ascending there. And we're going to start feeding our dragons. Let's do this. So here, I want to go with one of our stronger dragons. Looks like it's going to be the bio-augmented vampire dragon. Let's get those beetles. Oh, yeah. And here, we're starting this off. It's looking good. We've got one, two, and three, four. Oh, awesome. Here, we're at four beetles right now. That makes five. And I think we got five in total. Let's go check that out real quick. So here, if we go back to the heroic race, we're at 31 out of 35. We need four more. Let's do this. So here, I'm going back to my dragon book, and we're going to get the next strongest dragon. Ooh, looks like it's going to be the bar dragon. Let's do this. Beautiful. And one. Two. Yeah, there we go. Here we're looking for three and one last beetle. This is looking fantastic. There it is. We just got the last beetle. We're moving on. Let's get this going. Ooh, here, lap five, node four missions. Here we have to win two league battles and we have to get items by hatching eggs. So here, let's go ahead right over here. I've got the mastery egg that's ready to hatch. Let's do it. Oh yeah, beautiful. So here, I'm going to put that on a legend habitat. Awesome. Super excited to add that dragon to my collection, and I can't wait to feed it to see how it does. Yeah. Here, of course, I'm loving Dragon City, and I'll do that a little bit later. Thank you very much. Here, let's keep this going. So we've got to hatch one more egg. So I'm going to do the same technique that I used for breeding. Here, you're just breeding and rebreeding the Terra and Terra dragons. So here, that's looking great. It doesn't take that much time. 15 seconds. It goes by pretty quickly. So here, we're going to have some eggs to hatch, and those shouldn't be uh, taking too much time. After that, the league battles. Let's go. So here, we're going to go to our battles, choose the league battles, and we're going to try to get at least two victories. Let's do this. Here, we're going for our first combat. Fingers crossed. Um, so here, our first, uh, our first dragon it doesn't seem to have any specialties. We're going with the Hydra dragon. It's got the red arrow. We're going to use our strong move and... Putang, looking pretty good. Here, we're going to use Legend Spell once again and Strong Yas Queen. There we go. So here, this is looking fantastic. Uh, my other two dragons are both strong, so I'm going to try to get a big move in. We're going to go with Legend Spell once more. And not too shabby. That did some good damage. We just lost that dragon, but no biggie. We've got two other dragons, and this is going pretty well. Next up, Pure Energy. Let's do this. Woo! And that went super well. Here, things are looking fabulous. I'm going to use Slash of Ages. It's got that red arrow we love. And here we go for the victory. Putang, looking fabulous. Oh, yeah. Here, I'm going to pause this, and we're going to watch the video for the extra 10 times reward in food. We just got that 10,000 food, and we're going for our second league battle. Let's do this. Fingers crossed. Come on. We want to get that victory here. Here, we've got our uh, beautiful dragon there, and uh, no dragons have a strong move against this dragon. So we're going to stick with this dragon, and not too shabby, could be better, could be worse. Here, we're going to do pure energy again, looking good. 
and we still got this here pure energy and putang we just won the first dragon there we've got two more to go so here i'm going to switch up we're going to use the high druid dragon and we're going to use the move with the red arrow pretty strong there got at least half the damage here we're going to go ahead do tumbleweed again and that's looking fantastic as well here it's one to one dragon we're going to go with slash of ages primal moves are really good against pure dragons and Woo! There we go. We just got the victory. Looking fabulous. Here we're going to go ahead and watch this video for the 10,000 food. Awesome. So we finished two out of two league battles. Now we just have to hatch an egg. Let's do this. Here we're going to go and we're going to be placing these Terra eggs. And hopefully we're going to have enough space for all of this. When it comes to breeding, you can sell the dragons. But when it comes to hatching, you actually have to place those dragons. So here, let's see one more dragon. We're going to go ahead and get rid of that level one terra dragon right there and that's looking great here whoop a days here we're gonna go ahead hatch this terra dragon egg looking good and we're just gonna continue the process so here go ahead and rebreed just like we do with breeding breeding the terra and terra dragons awesome so here it takes a little bit of time i guess we can start collecting some gold we've got a bunch of gold waiting for us here looking good here we've got some gold i'm going to collect it all awesome so here are terra eggs they're ready to hatch so we're going to go ahead and place these right over here looking fabulous oh yeah come on little flower so you got to be patient it's going to take a couple of these terra dragons but we're going to see that beautiful flower in no time here we go so we're just breeding rebreeding and hatching and then repeating yeah so here we're just going to be uh getting uh we're going to be selling these little terra dragons level one here we don't really need those and you can recall them if ever you want to get the terra dragon orbs but right now i'm just cruising through this beautiful so here we're going to go ahead sell that sell this next and we've got plenty of space to go here we're going to go ahead hatch this egg and yes hey we got the flower Ooh, that's awesome and now we're moving on to lap five node five here we've got to get items by collecting food and we've got to get items by winning the battles let's go so here at the battles there's four battles and it could take a total of five hours for this let's get this started woo oh yeah looking good here we're going with the milky way dragon again and i'm starting with ghostly blades Woo! one hit victory looking fabulous and now we're gonna have to wait an hour i have a feeling it's gonna be one hour plus another hour plus three hours so one two and five hours in total for these battles the encounters that we have right here and when it comes to collecting food we've got a pool of nine out of 14 whoops so here we're going to be able to get nine of these dragon fruit out of 14 and then we're going to have to wait an hour and 20 minutes if i'm not mistaken so let's go ahead and start collecting some food here this is looking great we've got four so far there i think we've got seven that makes eight and let's just check where we're at here we're at nine out of 14 okay perfect so here when it comes to the food we're just going to be patient with that since we've got to wait a good five hours for the battles here no matter what we're going to be waiting so i'm going to go ahead and what i'm going to do here is i'm going to set up some three hour food here this is going to make it so that while we're waiting for our battles we're going to have some good food waiting for us and things will be flowing smoothly yeah you know you can always grow the 30 second food but i still want to keep some good food reserves for feeding my dragons later on i'm starting by feeding the lower level dragons but eventually during the heroic race i've got some higher level dragons that i would love to feed so i'm keeping my food reserves for now but eventually we're going to be spending a little bit more food and it's going to get really spicy in here yeah so here just going to set all that to three hour food and the other food that's ready to collect i guess i'll save it beautiful so here we've got that three hour food right there here we're going to set the three hour food and here same thing three hour food since we've got this wait time that means we can go ahead and collect all of the gold here so no biggie there and here i sent some dragons to the tower let's see yes they got the tower piece awesome so that is super exciting there. super stoked about that 
and eh, we'll have to get some of these uh, element dragons ready for the next battle. Back to collecting gold here. And yeah, that's looking great. So here we're just getting all our gold. We don't need to collect gold right away. We've got plenty of time to restock on that gold. And things are looking fabulous. Here, just collecting that, everything that's ready. And here we can go ahead and collect that gold as well. So at this point, we're just going to be waiting for these to continue. We've got about 57 minutes, 14 seconds to wait for our next encounter. And we'll be collecting a little bit of food in about an hour and 20 minutes. See you soon. We're back. It's time for the second encounter. And here we're going against the Orc Dragon. Let's do this. Here we're going to go ahead, of course, select our dragon. We're going to get that Milky Way Dragon. And we've got to be close to getting that A- minus rank sometime soon. Here we go. So, so far not too strong against us. And, ooh, yeah, our dragon did great. Victory. Now we've got to wait another hour for the next Virtue Dragon battle. And then I think we're going to have to wait three hours for the last battle. But we're making progress and things are looking great. It's been about an hour here and we're about to go with the encounter against the Virtue Dragon. Let's do this. Here we should be able to get that victory. Knock on wood. Hopefully things go well. After this battle, we're going to have three hours of waiting time. And here, ooh, we've got a strong move. Primitive Ram Putang, looking great. We got that victory. And yep, we have to wait three hours for the next encounter. Since it's been at least two hours, we should be able to collect that food. So here, I had a little bit of food earlier there. And whoa, we got four dragon fruit. Oh, did I say four? Well, we got, I think four. We're still one short. So we just have to get one more dragon fruit. I'm probably going to have time to wait for this food over here. Otherwise, you can always try the 30 second food if you want to go for that right away. Beautiful. Here we go. I'm just curious. Will we get it there? Right now, there's an hour, less than an hour left on the food. So, of course, I could be patient, but I'm wondering. I'm feeling the luck right now. Maybe we can get another dragon fruit with the 30-second food here. And here we've got that. I can't find the one where we have to build food. Anyways, here, this is going great. There it is. Yeah. And we're going to get the blueberry bouquet there not too shabby. Here, I'm going to go ahead and collect that food. And we've got a little bit more food there. We can also go ahead and collect our gold, of course. And oh yeah, here earlier, we finished empowering a dragon. Here, we're going to go ahead and get that gold rush dragon. Yeah, it got its first star there. So now we're going to be able to level it up all the way to level 45, not just 40, with extra health and attack. Super cool. Here, Let's see what else we have in the mix. I've got a couple orbs for a bunch of different things. Um, ooh, deja vu. I like that. Here we're going to go ahead and empower the deja vu dragon. Yeah, I've got 155 orbs and I only need 120. So we're good to go there. That's going to take 23 hours. All good. And here's our food. Oh, no dragon fruit there. Here we're going to regrow that and we'll just keep trying. All good, looking fantastic. Here, there's this new um, island floating over here, and that'll take you, you know, where you go in the Dragon, uh, the Dragon TV? That island is now a quick access to the games that you can play for extra gems. So that's really cool there. So if ever you're wondering, what's that? That's the opportunity to play some games to get free gems. Super cool. Here we've got a little bit more gold. I'm going to go ahead and collect that. And that's looking great there. Get a little bit of gold there. And yeah, rock on. Here our food's ready. I'm going to go ahead and collect that. And still no dragon fruit. Hey, if ever you're in a hurry, maybe it might be interesting to, once we get all the dragon fruit, to skip this battle. Uh, when you think about it, you know, it's three hours, so it's not that long. We're probably going to want to save some gems for later on. But, you know, sometimes, uh, you know, when it's uh, there's only one item left to get out of everything, I think it's only three gems to finish it. So this, I don't think it's worth it necessarily here, even though I'm kind of feeling tempted. Um, you know, I'm thinking about it there. So here, no dragon fruit, but definitely thinking about, you know, maybe fast forwarding that. 
lap five might not be as necessary. You know, we're waiting five hours in total. So yeah, I kind of want to fast forward things, but patience is a virtue. And when it comes to fast forwarding stuff, um, on lap six, a little bit further, we're not there yet, but we're getting there. Lap six, there's gonna be some battles on lap six, node four, and that's gonna take seven hours. So that might be a place where I might wanna save those gems for there instead of fast forwarding it right now. But for uh, for example, if ever you're going on vacation or something, it could be pretty, uh, you know, a good strategy to go ahead and finish that node right there depends on what you want to do here it's more expensive gem wise so make sure you click that finish node three gems there and when it goes to the battle don't click that there that's 12 gems so that's going to be big there and have fun with it yeah otherwise i'll see you in three hours thanks so much for watching and we're back here it's been three hours and we're ready finally to go for that battle against the corruption dragon let's do this here of course we're going to select our dragon get that milky way dragon and let's go oh yeah i am so excited to finish this lap hopefully we're going to be able to pull off the victory let's go light star Woo! And we got it! Victory, y'all queen! And for this, we get an epic egg. Here we go. Big money, big money! And, ooh, we just got the Brawl Dragon. Ooh, looking super cool. Hey, that is awesome. And with that, we are officially moving on to lap six. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button for the like and subscribe. And stay tuned for the lap six video coming soon. Hey, things are looking fabulous right now. And while we're here, uh, I do have an egg to hatch. Since we have an egg to hatch, I'm going to get an egg out of our storage. Here, let's see, which dragon should we do? Uh, looking over here. I'm thinking, uh, I want to put a dragon in there. What should it be? Maybe the underground dragon? Yep, I'm going for it. And that's going to take 24 hours hatching time. Hey, thanks again so much for watching. Hope to see you soon and happy gaming, everybody. Peace.